You're watching Big Tie. Alright, so we're back with another re review. Today we're doing the single scene review that I've been doing, or betting on probably, um, where I just review a single skin from a bundle, because some people only want to buy the skin, and um, my only qu criteria, I don't know that word, whatever, uh, prerequisite, I can't even speak, whatever, um, is the, the skin had to have been never in a bundle before. It could have just been solo, you know, um, like a locker bundle, or like this bundle right here, the Catwoman bundle. Um, they just added the bundle decently recently, I would say, and yeah, so you get the Catwoman skin, which is 1,500 with the back bling, the, I didn't put it on right yet, but the jeweled cat, and you get the edits out for the goggles up. So uh, yeah, I'll put the back bling on and we'll go into battle labs. Let's do it. All right, so here's the Catwoman skin with the default pickaxe, and I know I just said we're going into battle labs. I caught myself at the end, but I stopped recording, so... Um, yeah, we're in creative. I, I don't know why I said the fuck about OBS. Whatever. Pull up. Swing. I like how all these, uh, old skins are getting new bundles. It's good. I do like that. Because I feel like, um, some of these skins were very expensive. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about that. Yeah. Damn. I hope Epic keeps doing these bundles. Bundles are great. It's cheaper if you already own some items. It's great. Bundles are the probably the biggest thing I've probably ever done, and it's really good. Let's do some ADS. We have the boogeyman wrap on. Splash, slurp, mini, vanishes, and fish. Big shield. <coughs> Check jug. One shot. Four. Backwards, left, right, not moving. There it is. It's a little building. Let's see if I can. Oh my god, I've been doing horrible lately. But what is that, dude? Oh my god. I Can I make the excuse I haven't played in like a week? I feel like I can, you know, end of the season. I don't know if this is going to go up at the end of the season, but this could go up in a couple weeks. At this Whatever. Prima. Yeah, pretty basic. Black, yellow, pink. Nothing crazy is going on. Let's do the edit style. Goggles up. And. Primal. Nothing crazy. Just see your face a little bit more. So, yeah, I guess we can go on a battle with now, and I'll tell you should you buy the Catwoman comic book skin? Comic book, I'll just call it the Catwoman because technically you don't have any other Catwoman except the zero one. But if I'm going to refer to the zero point one, then I'm going to say the zero one. But yeah, let's go into battle ops. All right, so we're in Battle of Zion. I'll tell you, should you buy the Catwoman skin? So you get the Catwoman outfit, which is 1,500, and the backling, which is pretty long. So that's it, the jeweled cat. Uh, it does have an install, but the edit style barely changes anything. and just puts the goggle up. 
all that changes. Nothing crazy is going on here. Um, so should you buy it? You know, it's all personal preference. You know, I can't say, oh, buy it, don't buy it, whatever. Um, personally, if I had the choice, I wouldn't buy it. It's a little overpriced for me. Um, to the emote for the home now. I've done this emote so many times for so many skins at this point to wear. <laughs> Probably the most emote you know I've done. I hate this emote, though. It's so stupid. Um, yeah, I think it is a good skin, but the price kind of shows where it's like, eh, I don't know. Catwoman isn't really as big as a character as it used to be. I feel like Catwoman was decently big back in, back in, um, you know, a couple of years ago before like Suicide Squad and shit. But then Suicide Squad came out and then Harley Quinn became the big thing. Harley Quinn was more like the sidekick and no one cared about her. Um, but now Harley Quinn's more of the Catwoman now. Um, so yeah, I nothing else to really say. There's nothing crazy going on. It's just a black outfit um, with an as I don't know pretty boring back playing at that 1500 for that i don't know personally no uh but you know it's all personal preference if you like the skin go ahead you'll probably like it more than i do um but yeah i paid for fucking 2000 v bucks for a john wick skin which well i use a lot but anyways that's really about it i have nothing else to say about the skin i think it's fine whatever but the price kind of shows to where maybe maybe an edit style or two um, extra should maybe boost the skin up in sales but yeah that's really about it see ya Sub if you liked the content. If you enjoyed the video leave a like. Follow Big Tie on social media if you want to see random shit.